stealing humans from the boardwalk. I don't know, but they're only taking my friends. They even got Connie. If we don't do something, they're going to take them into space. And our spaceship got jacked. So if they leave Earth, they'll be gone for good. Now let's not be hasty here, would that really be a bad thing? I mean, yeah, they got Connie and she's cool, but they're taking the others too, and they suck. They must be collecting more humans for the zoo. But there's loads of humans on Earth. Why are they only grabbing your friends? Maybe because my friends are the best. For the first time in the series, me and Pearl agree on something. I swear the next person who names me Barbie on Battle.net gets an axe to the forehead. Just let the humans go. Uh, no. Who are these Dalits? We're the crystal gems, you chump. Yeah, yeah. Rose Quartz is old lackeys. That was in the report, too. We're not here for any of you rogue gems. We'll leave you totally alone. If. You tell us where we can find my dad. Okay, so knowing how this series works, one of two things is going to happen. Either they're going to fuse and kick ass like they always do, or they're going to forget that they can fuse and just lie down and give up like they always do. My spear can reach her without hurting the hostages. Oh, you're so smart. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Oh, for fuck's sake, they couldn't get whoever voices Opal, Smokey, or Sardonyx, could they? Can you remind me? I mean, my memory is perfect, but our orders were to bring back these six humans. I'm just not sure. Did they specify... alive? Man, we could really use Commander Shepard here. No, you won't. Oh my god. Hostages only work when your enemy cares if they live. Oh, hi Lars! You know Lars, this is an improvement for you. Very nice meeting you all, and your compliance is appreciated, but... Pearl, that was fucking weak. A neon death trap which has imprisoned us so tightly like a winter coat that's too big in the sleeve. Lars, stop! Really I need to concentrate! Away. Lars, can you stop being a massive cunt for five seconds? Steven! Let's fuse! We're already in the air. How are we going to get back? Steven! Best idea was just proposed! Fucking take it and stop muttering, oh my god, don't fuck this up! <laughs> Good job, Lars. Now sew up those stupid fucking holes in your ears and do something productive. Connie! I'm sorry! What are you talking about? It's my fault you were abducted! <laughs> Why everyone was taken! If it weren't for me, the diamonds wouldn't have come for my friends! If it weren't for my mom, they wouldn't even be trying to destroy the Earth! Oh, for the love of- Stop crying and fuse! The door, right! Oh, well, it's about fucking time. Why didn't you open with that? Nice try, but it's hopeless, my dad. I can't go back to Homeworld without getting what the diamonds want. Well, crap, Steven. If only you had some kind of weapon that could make a simple punch to the face extremely effective with the gem right there. Wouldn't that be great, Steven? If you could uh, deal with this problem immediately with a single punch to the face at the perfect angle that you've been given. Right, Steven? Right? Wouldn't that just solve everything? If you could just get right down to Bismuth? Right, Steven? Right? No, no, you're totally fine. time oh, it's about fucking time you've got the ultimate you've got the ultimate win card and you just never use it